Hello all. Today I am going to share the interview questions I have faced in ITC Infotech testing interview. So basically the skill set is uh, functional testing, API testing and automation testing. Automation testing is with respect to Java with Selenium and Cucumber BDD framework. So the first question is you have to check an API what are all you require. So this is first question and second one is like explain bug life cycle. And third one is a user story is given to you for testing purpose. How will you start working on it? Fourth one is difference between SOAP and REST API. Fifth one is different exceptions you have received in your script. This is basically a Selenium question. And uh, how to remove style element exception. And how to handle multiple windows in Selenium. And uh, eighth question is a scenario based like there is an element in the web page. We are able to locate the web element but unable to click. So already click was uh, used in that particular element uh, location but still we are unable to use uh, click that. So is there any alternative click we can use. So that is the question. And ninth one is like also scenario based. There is an element in the web page and it has an attribute as ID and the attribute value the value of the id is dynamically changing so do you know how to handle it in 10th one is there is a string it's a java program and the string can is like uh, it contains two spaces and also one space like this like test two spaces test one space tester two spaces test so uh, interviewer asked me to paste it as a single word without any space we have to remove two spaces and one space as well and 11th question is like there are two tables and like one first table is like employee and second table is address so how to get the address of an employee write the sql query how to make a connection to both the tables this is an sql query and difference between put and patch do you you have to create something in the api what do you what you have to do and this is another question and fourth is there is a get request you have to verify the output and capture the value dynamically and that output you have to like uh, give in the next post method as input so is it possible in the postman so it's a scenario based question in the api testing and uh, what are all there in headers in api testing how is it useful so about headers and what are the different methods used in api testing and also 17th one is a uh, scenario based like there is an API having ID employee name and email you have to write the test cases to test by using get and post methods what are all the test cases you will cover so we have to explain about the test cases what are all will cover to test this particular API so thank you